Okay. If you give a moose some bacon, he's gonna want some scrambled eggs to go with that bake with those bacon strips and bacon strips and bacon strips and bacon strips. And then he's gonna ask you for bacon strips. You know what? You've got no more, jerk. He ate them all. Now, you're gonna have to go to the store to buy some more bacon strips. And you know what? He's gonna wanna go with you. So he's gonna go outside and he's gonna realize it's shim it's freezing outside. So he's gonna ask to go to ask to borrow a coat. You're gonna give him a coat, because you're nice. And now, he's gonna realize that one of the buttons on the coat is loose. So he's gonna ask for a needle and thread. You're gonna give him a needle and thread, and he's gonna start sewing. Give him a second, he's sewing. <laughs> And as he's sewing, he's, it reminds him of his grandmother, who used to make sock puppets. Forget that. Give me some old socks. You bring him old socks. Humor me, Moose. Now, with the old socks, he makes sock puppets. Now, he's going to want to put on a show, as all great sock puppet ears want. So he's going to want some background, some awesome background. So you're going to bring him some paints and some cardboard. With some paints and cardboard, he gives to you and asks you, to make his background hooves. So after you're done making his background, he's gonna find a show. But his antlers stick out, because he has huge antlers. So he's gonna ask you to get something to cover them up with. You're gonna bring him a sheet. The best sheet ever. And so you're gonna put it on him. And then as he's wearing the sheet, trying to put on the show, he's gonna He's going to realize that he wanted to be a ghost for Halloween. So he's going to get up and start frolicking with his sheet on his head and pretending he's a ghost. And he's going to go, boom! Then he's going to scare himself and spill all your paints everywhere. And I mean everywhere. <laughs> and so he's going to clean it all up with your sheet. Thanks a lot, Moose. <laughs> and now he's going to ask for some soap to clean the sheet because he's not a jerk. And then he's going to ask to go hang it up outside. So that way he can drive. So when he goes outside to hang it up to dry, he's going to see the chicken coop. When he sees the chicken coop, that's going to remind him of the scrambled eggs. And he's going to go inside and ask you to make him some more scrambled eggs. And then, chances are, if he wants scrambled eggs, he's going to want some bacon to go in. Okay, go. Oh. He didn't even do that. It's my fault. Wait, there's no arrows, though. Touch the board. Oh, yeah. All right. My story is if you give a pig a pancake. Yeah. If you give a pig a pancake, she wants some syrup to go with it. You'll give her some of your favorite maple syrup. She'll probably get all sticky, so she'll want to take a bath. She'll ask you for some bubbles. When you give her the bubbles, she'll probably want ask you for a toy. You'll have to find your rubber duck. The duck will remind her of the farm where she was born. She might feel homesick and want to visit her family. She'll want you to come too. She'll look through your closet for a suitcase. Then she'll look under your bed. When she's under your bed, she'll find your old tap shoes. She'll try them on. She'll probably need something special to wear with them. Uh, when shoes, no, when she's all dressed, she'll ask you for some music. You'll play your very best piano piece and she'll start dancing. Then she'll want you to take her picture, so you'll have to get your camera. When she sees the picture, she'll ask you to take more. Then she'll want to send one to each of her friends. You'll have to give her some envelopes and stamps and take her to the mailbox. <coughs> On the way, she'll see the tree in your backyard. She'll want to build a tree house. You'll give, you will have to give her some wood, a hammer, and some nails. When the tree house is finished, she'll want to decorate it. She'll ask for some wallpaper and glue. When she hangs the wallpaper, she'll get all sticky. Feeling sticky she will remind her of your favorite maple syrup. She'll probably ask you for some, and chances are, if she, if she, if she asks you for more syrup, she'll want a pancake to go with it. Story I'm doing is called Moo, Ba, Ba, La. Cow says Moo, sheep says Ba. Three singing pigs say La, La, La. No, no, you say that isn't right. Sheep say, or pigs say, point all day and night. Rhinoceros says, screw it and snuff. And little dogs go, ruff, ruff, ruff. Some other dogs go, bow, wow, wow. <laughs> and cats and kittens say, meow. Quack says the duck, 
The horse says nay. It's quiet now. What do you say? Hey! <laughs>